spend the rest of my life with the same one, same one. Ain't no I and T. I'ma bring you good love, just come with me. Baby, you're all the company. I hey, you guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am your favorite girl, A. Marie. Today's video is gonna be a quick haul okay that's all i can explain is it's a haul i got a whole bunch of stuff for christmas and my birthday and i wanted to pop in and just share with you guys what i got for my birthday and christmas if it's anything that you guys would like to see like a clothing haul a makeup tutorial or something along those lines let your girl know down below in the comment section this video was an ask for, but I wanted to share with you guys on the things that I got because I'm super excited for the things I got for my birthday and Christmas. I'm truly blessed. Everything that I wanted, I got. So I just wanted to share with you guys. So if you're interested in seeing what I got for Christmas and my birthday, then just keep watching. But before we go any further, I would love for you to like this video, hit the subscribe button, as well as the notification turn your post notification to all so you won't miss another upload from your girl as well as leave me a comment down below let's jump into it <laughs> it's a quick video well not a quick video but a haul video and you guys are gonna see me getting up and all that because i'm gonna like post a little clip right here of how this area over here is looking it is full it's jam-packed i wanted to go ahead and give you guys this haul because i'm ready to use my stuff like i'm ready to use it so hopefully you guys have been enjoying all the new year videos Ugh, i've been kicking for new years okay we're coming out back to back with a lot of bangers so a lot of these products is a mixture of my birthday and Christmas and I won't go in order. I'm just going to grab. And if you're looking for a tutorial on this look, you guys, I did not bring it to YouTube, but I did bring it to my Instagram. I do have a IGTV video over there on this whole spiel right here. So if you guys want to see how I created this look, then Go show me some love on my Instagram. Y'all know I'm trying to do things different over there on my Instagram. And I'm trying to get more active. So I would love for you guys to follow me and show me some love over there. But if you guys want a look here on YouTube of this look right here, just let your girl know and I'll get it done for you guys. We're going to start off with the bags, the bag of things that I bought from Rainbow. You guys, my sister has been telling me to go to Rainbow like ever since I've been living in Houston and I just never did. I never went. I got a lot of things. <clears throat> my brother did give me some birthday money, so I spent all my birthday money on Christmas gifts. If you guys haven't seen what my kids and my wife got for Christmas, then I will have that video linked because y'all... I went, I went a little wild, okay? I went a little wild. But like I said, my sister was telling me to go to Rainbow and I wouldn't go to Rainbow for some reason. So I finally did and I got me some accessories because I love accessories. So I did get these silver hoops and I really got it just for these right here, these big ones. You guys know, like, as you can tell, I love big hoops. So, this was the biggest size I've seen thus far. So, I needed to get them. And they came with two other ones. And I just had to. This here, y'all, it's all tangled up again. I untangled it already. And it's just not... Every time I put it in this bag, you guys, it gets tangled right back up. Okay, so it came with these hoop earrings. They're the gold ones. These two, no, this one has little rhinestones on it. 
and these are regular hoops this one got ridges to it and then this is just plain gold like that but i really got this because of the queen piece on it and it has this rose on it and i was going to give it to my niece but i didn't realize that this whole ordeal is one chain so that's the accessories i got so let's move over into the clothing pieces i got i got a couple of little pieces if you guys would like to see a um try on haul from rainbow let your girl know because i will do it now granted i have gained quite a few pounds i gained a lot of weight so a lot of my stuff is in small and medium you guys let me know if y'all want a clothing haul but i did get this shirt excuse the people in the background you guys there's people outside but i did get a shirt that says melanated beauty and it is a hoodie and it has little wordings on it i got a lot of these type of shirts so yeah it's a hoodie but it also shrinks up on the sides of the shirt which i love <laughs> I like that. Hopefully you guys want a clothing haul on this so that I can actually show show y'all because girl, I brought y'all back some because the clothing is like taking up all the room. <clears throat> so I did get this t-shirt type of shirt but it's a onesie and it's supposed to fit like a t-shirt rainbow had a lot of these on sale so i did get a couple of colors here is the black and white one and yes it's a onesie and these are all in a size small i also got this shirt you guys Ooh, i love this onesie look at this Ooh, talking about bed I did buy some jeans. All the jeans that I bought are the booty lifting jeans. <laughs> it's called the push up collection. So yeah, I did get these. They're super freaking cute too. I love them. Um, these are in a size seven, which I believe I wear now. I didn't try anything on because I was really looking and grabbing. Oh, and it got the rips in the front, too. Yes. So, I got these, which are the high-rise push-up jeans. They're all the way ankles, and they fit, They do like the same. They have the little rip in the front, but these go all the way down. Back pockets are like that, and this is in a size 5. And then, for the last little piece, I just had to have these joggers. You guys, these are like leather joggers, and it has the side pockets on it. It goes, it has the ruffle on the bottom. These are in a size medium. Hopefully, these work and fit because, y'all, I was in love. You hear me? I did go to Sephora. I had to pick up a gift, get my birthday gift, and there was a palette that I've been wanting for a while, so I had to get it. Here is the birthday gift. It was either out of the Dolce, Dolce De Niro, Dolce De Niro body bum bums or the milk. So I decided to get the milk because I get the bum bum creams in like all my boxy charms. Birthday said it's the milk Kush mascara, the Hydro Grip primer, and a blush. It looks like it's nothing new, but the palette that I wanted is the Too Faced Pumpkin Spice palette. And this one is limited edition. So once they stop selling it, I would unfortunately stop showing it on, <sighs> on my channel. But you guys, I've been wanting this palette for a long time. Everybody should know what this look like. She's so pretty and warm tone. Oh, she smells like vanilla. I thought it was gonna smell like pumpkin. My wife did buy me this Calvin Klein crossbody purse. 
she said that she was tired of me um like when i run out to the store i just grab my wallet and go and she said she was tired of seeing me do that so she bought me a small purse um knowing i don't wear small purses she said this will be something to like grab my wallet or grab my money and just run to the store and throw this over my shoulder so i thought it was a cute thought that was cute i was like you know what that could be right <laughs> I might as well use one of these when I'm running to the store instead of holding my wallet in my hand or holding my wallet and my cell phone in my hand. Use this little bad boy and I think it's cute. Y'all are probably hearing the kids out there in my background. They're outside playing. Not my kids, but kids that live in these apartments. You guys know my filming area is in my garage. So it happens. We did pick up the holiday popcorns, you guys. Holiday popcorn has been a tradition to me since I was a young kid from as long as I can remember. My mom used to always buy me a can of popcorn for Christmas and I always, always, always loved them. So as I got older and as I started having kids, this transferred to my tradition with my kids. So every year we get four cans of popcorn, let everybody choose their can and go hard. But this here, this year, you guys, the popcorn used to be divided into the can and just filled up. This year at Walmart, you guys, they put them in bags, which I was like, that's smart. Like, finally. So you don't, when you open it, you don't have to eat, you know, every single one and cause every single one of them to go stale every time you open it. Now you could just open whatever, whatever bag you want it to eat and put it back in and it is save it a lot longer. I thought that was so cool, but I picked this one because it matches my Christmas pants. <laughs> Let's dig through my stocking real quick. I did get a lip gloss for my niece gloss ballet if you have a daughter a niece goddaughter that loves lip gloss y'all need to check out my 12 year old niece because she has her own business i will have her tag right here on the screen um you could place your order through instagram and she's really affordable and all her stuff is super freaking cute um i think i have this candy cane but you guys my kids can eat this because I have to be in the mood for chocolate like that. Just showing y'all really quickly what's in the, the stocking. Um, it's really mostly candy. <laughs> my son gave me a $20 bill. My other son gave me a Chick-fil-A gift card. I did go ahead and put that in my, in my wallet. But Babe bought me Snickers. If y'all don't know... Y'all don't know, and uh, if y'all ever wonder what to send me, if y'all wanted to send me a gift, send me Snickers. All right, and then I was putting candies in the stockings, of course. So I got a lot of candy. My other favorite fruity candy, Snickers is my favorite chocolate candy, but Mamba's is my favorite fruity candy. Y'all, these and hot shoes, I can't get enough. So, this big box, I gotta lean back a little bit. My mom bought this for my birthday, and I was super, super excited because if you guys don't know, or if y'all do know, I do own my own business. I have lashes, which I have on now. I have lashes, lip gloss, body care, skin care. I have almost everything that you could think of. And I had been asking my mom to use her product, her device for the longest. And I was like, you know what? She told me I could use it and she, <laughs> I was supposed to go pick it up, but I never did. And I was like, Ugh, I need to get me one one day. Like I need to get one. But mommy came through. Mommy came through and got your girl a stand and hand mixer. 
when I say y'all I was excited I could literally mix my glosses in here my body scrubs my facial scrubs like all my oils that I use. I can use this for everything that's in my business and it is little so it's little I could take the handle off and on this thing right here I could take it off and on I could mix it sitting on the stand or I could use use it in my hand like oh yeah I was super excited and so blessed I was shocked that she bought it because I didn't think you know nobody really like just paid attention considering my business is very new but girl you guys I never even told y'all what all I asked for for Christmas to be honest but to be honest with you guys I asked for a lot of household things like kitchen appliance like sounds random sounds strange but i was expecting to get like a new mop a new broom you know some more pots and pans new dish sets like because i'm an at-home mom now and i've been like actually i've been actually like really 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 using all of the things that i have in my house instead of being a working mom and using stuff here and there you know very little type of things i was like you know what i want household stuff i want household stuff because i'm at home 24 7 now so i got more than household items but that's really what i asked for this year so i did get the j sculpt waist trainer for my birthday um I did ask for this as well because you guys will be seeing here shortly I'm gonna do a video on how to gain weight minus BBL surgery stuff like that and I've always had the Keisha Kaior waist trainer but a lot of my YouTube girls have been wearing this and the latest person I seen order this was Keisha Kaylee and I was like Dang, like Aaliyah's face had it, Keisha K. Lee. I mean, every beauty guru has a J sculpt. So, Aaliyah, yes, she got the BBL, but she still also works out and stuff. And Keisha K. Lee, she during last year was, you know, trying to gain her little weight after having her baby jewelry, and she didn't have no surgery. So I was like, you know what? It's time for me to retire my Keisha, my Keisha Kaior's waist trainer and hop over to the J Sculpt. I did get a size small. On the website, you're supposed to measure yourself like all the way around, but I didn't. I was just like, I'm a small. I don't care. Whatever. <laughs> Y'all, this thing sucks your life in okay my wife was like maybe i should have got medium i was like uh-uh because the smile is gonna work just fine for me i love the way it snatches everything in i haven't did a lot of workouts with it but you guys will see it in the how to gain weight little video that i'm already putting together it's a lot of work that's going into that video but you guys hopefully Y'all are going to enjoy it and love it and gain some tips from it. Be on the lookout for that video. It's coming up very, very, very soon. Subscribe. Post notification to all so you don't miss that video. Okay? So, the next thing. I told you guys I was going to be leaning a lot. I got this two-piece sweat set my wife bought me for christmas this one is in a size small i love it it's a jacket and it has the bottoms to it and the bottoms are like joggers here's some pockets and stuff i thought the colors were so fire um here's the bottom part oh they're not joggers they're sweats because they go full length here we go but they do scrunch up at the bottom so you can turn them into joggers if you like but they do have pockets on them and everything no back pockets or anything just the front pockets and it comes with the drawstring 
my wife also got me this cardigan jacket she knows i love wearing things like this so i'm trying to find a top so she was like you know what i want to get her one so she did and it's just a knitted one and it has like red in it but it's black with hints of red in it and i thought it was so cute she also got your girl some new her bristles broke okay i was like how does this work so i did get some bras so just showing you guys real quick super freaking cute on how they lay came out cute peach and black and then she got me this shirt that is a hoodie which another thing you guys i love t-shirts with hoodies on it i don't know why it's just my thing but it says faith on the front it has faith on the sleeves as well as love it live it walk it talk it own it loan it grow it show it faith these two were in my stocking as well house shoes you guys it seems like every i'm gonna say at least um five times a year my wife buys me new house shoes because i wear my house shoes everywhere i wear house shoes all the time in the house when i run to the store stuff like i'm always in my house shoes y'all i'm always and i always have soft bottoms like this so if i wear them too much it'll create a hole and i won't wear them out no more but i don't like throwing away my house shoes so she always throws mine away and buys some more so these two were in my stocking if y'all seen the Christmas video, y'all seen that I bought my boys a mini fridge and I also bought my wife a mini fridge. So it would only be right if, if I bought myself a mini fridge. This one is the marble one. It's marble. I'm going to use it for my skincare because I've been wanting a skincare refrigerator. So... I got one and it matches my background and I think I'm gonna leave it in here or maybe I'm gonna put it in my bathroom I don't know yet but I can't wait to bust it open all right I told y'all I was gonna be doing all this moving around <laughs> but I edit those parts out y'all I'm like dragging stuff <sighs> over here just to have it in frame um but like I told you guys I wanted appliances for Christmas so my sister got me a kitchen aid it's a it's by kitchen aid it's a fry skillet if I'm not mistaken and it's Teflon it is a fried skillet you guys I'm telling y'all I've been wanting stuff like this like for real for real I know this sounds weird but you guys I have been getting into cooking and stuff like that so Babe also got me this. Now, look, I think she was trying to tell me something when she bought this stuff because it's another little ordeal that's going to go with this. She bought me <laughs> this spa sponge. It's for your feet. It's a scrub. It says 20 washes. It's a 4-in-1. Cleanses, exfoliate, moisturize, and massages. This is lavender tea tree oil. I guess the tea tree and lavender with shea, br shea butter is inside this scrub. So I am going to use it. I think she's trying to tell me my feet are rough. So I need to use it. She also got me this Mariah Carey Luscious Pink gift set. I never heard of this at all. I didn't even know Mariah Carey had little gift sets like this. But it is... It has the body wash, the spray, the lotion, and a bath bomb. So, I was excited to have that. Alright, and then my sister also got me. Oh, this is a fry pan too. She also got me this fry pan and it's a cast iron pot or skillet. Like, it's kitchen and tables from... H-E-B is durable, 
beautiful in its cookware is what the box say but i'm excited to have it i hope it has a lid to it honestly i hope it has a lid to it because really y'all should see my wife in the background okay <laughs> Yeah, the things she do behind the camera. But the main thing I asked for you guys, it's not the end of the haul, but the main thing I asked for, I got it and I'm gonna have to get my ass up in order for it to fit in this frame. So, I see everybody using air fryers nowadays. Ashley Devonna cooks a lot of her meals in the air fryer. So she cooks a lot of things in her air fryer, y'all. I'm hot now. All this moving. But a lot of her salmon meals and stuff like that, her vegetables and stuff, it's in an air fryer. And my other oldest sister has an air fryer and she made a meal and she had made me she had gave me a plate and it was just so freaking good and she was like girl i use the air fryer and if you guys don't know me y'all my worst fear is fire hot stuff grease stuff like that that is my worst freaking fear and majority of my meals that i cook will not be in grease i don't do fried food i don't I don't do french fries i don't do bacon stuff like that anything that's gonna cause some type of pain to me when i cook i'm not here for it okay not here for it my kids and my wife love fried food so my wife has to do all that because your girl cannot get popped by grease your girl cannot have a grease fire like i don't do it I don't do it so my old my older sister told me like girl get your air fryer it fries everything and I was like what is that so I started looking into them and I was like I want an air fryer so Bay got me an air fryer my wife also got me another skincare product she bought me a skincare product a while back now the thing is when my wife goes to the store and stuff she always say like you want something from the store and i'd be like uh yeah like i don't care what store she goes to i need something out of that store to tell you how serious it is her and my niece went to lowe's during christmas to get some light bulbs and she knows me she knows that if she would have called me and be like you want something out of lowe's i'd have said yes even though I don't build not a damn thing. But she brought me a little mini Santa Claus that dances and he had a rainbow hat on. I was in love. I was shocked. I was in love. Like, I love it. And she was like, yeah, I knew you was going to like that gay stuff. Like, you and these rainbows thought about you. And she got me that out of Lowe's. So, she went to Walmart one day and... She was like, is it anything you need out of Walmart? I couldn't think of anything. Y'all know Walmart sells like 50,000 things. Couldn't think of anything. And I was like, you know what? Surprise me. But don't bring nothing dumb. Like, surprise me. So she bought me a Vanity Place. Um, is it Vanity Place? Vanity Place, I think it's called. I would insert like a little clip. It's a, a Vanity Place face steamer. And I have been wanting a face steamer for the longest because I see all the beauty gurus say that the face steamers, you know, really help your skin. And you guys know that I'm like a skin complexion. Like this face can't be messed up, can't be bumped up. Like I just, I can't stand it. So she told me that there's a whole line of things that is in that type of collection when it comes down to skincare and she was like i'm gonna get you every single thing that's on that shelf in due time so for christmas i got my second piece this is a l and w 
L and W Bio. This is a Beauty Vac Ultra Suction Pore Cleanser. Now, the benefits of it is it removes blackhead and whiteheads, it gets rid of oils and dead skin, and it stimulates the skin. Okay. So, and y'all, if y'all don't know me, I'm a Dr. Pimple Popper watcher, like hard. None of that type of stuff disgusts me. And I just can't wait to use this because I want to see it actually pull out some bumps, you know, the nasty little stuff. So it comes like this, y'all. This lighting is like tearing it out. So here's the suction. It has a suction cup on there, but it comes with three other ones. The small round one is suitable for thin and tender skin. The large one is a great suction for your forehead and your chin. And then the elliptical whole head is for lift fine lines and pour oh wait lift fine lines and promotes blood circulation and this says it's by Lux Lux and Willow is the brand and I don't know if that's a sister company to Vanity Place but if I'm not mistaken my steamer said Vanity Place and you guys I use that that face steamer on Wednesdays and Sundays every week and it has done some some changes to me you guys will see an in-depth skincare routine from your girl we're working on it i'm telling y'all subscribe to my channel click the notification to all so you won't miss the things that i got coming this channel is about to grow and take a whole new level of steps like we're leveling up over here and a skincare routine i realized i think i've done a skincare routine like once on my channel and that was years ago and it looked horrible so the updated more professional look of a skincare video is coming and this is going to be a part of it now because i got it all right we're getting down to the nitty-gritty i also got what is this called again? The Zen Within. The Zen Within Muscle Relax Luxe Collection. My wife got me this. So it comes with the Muscle Relief Bath and Shower Gel. Here is the Bath Salt. Here is the... What is that? It's a body oil. A body oil and the little loofah not the loofah this the sponge yeah maybe loofah and it says it smells like fresh wood i have the foot scrub and then i have the body lotion now all this is supposed to be for relaxing your muscles and it's a seven piece bath set like I told my wife now i need a we have a garden tub and I want one of those bench things that lay across because she knows <clears throat> she knows I love to take baths and soak. I kill the body. I kill the bath bombs with the Epsom salt and stuff like that. And I would just sit in the tub and just relax, soak it all in. And then I'll get up and, you know, bathe myself and stuff. But I love taking baths and this is going to... Hopefully this is going to work, especially for the muscles. So, can't wait, can't wait, can't wait. Okay, then she surprised me with this perfume. I didn't even know this perfume existed. You guys, I got Apple Bottom Perfume. Like, Apple, Apple Bottom Perfume. And it's super cute. I didn't even know this was a thing. I thought Apple Bottoms was like long gone. But look at it. It is in the shape of an apple. It says apple bottoms. It is super freaking cute. And she smells good. She smells like apples to me. I kept telling my wife that. It smells like apples for some reason. Hey, you guys. Editing A. Marie here. Um, while I was editing this video, I felt like I was missing some items. And I realized I never showed you guys my shoes that I bought myself because... Your girl had already put them up. But these right here 
are one pair you guys i thought these were so freaking fire i found these at um shoe carnival and they're just the belly simo bellissimo bellissimo i'm dumb y'all know um but anyways they're black and they're size eight they're like this suede boot i purchased my kids and my wife some tennis shoes for christmas and at shoe carnival they were all shoes were buy one get one half off so i bought both of my boys a pair of shoes and then I, I bought my wife a pair of shoes so i needed one more pair of shoe just to make it feel like i got a deal you know what i mean so i picked these up and these are black suede like i said nice nice heel I thought these were so freaking beautiful and if you guys do not know i may have haven't said it yet but all 2021 baby girl i am getting my shoe game up a lot of flip-flops and sandals but i want more sandals boots and heels so that's what i've been focusing on a whole lot when it comes to shoes love these and then I found these at Ross. These were $34. I found them at Ross. This is another pair of boots. And it just got this sheep shaggy type of ordeal around it and in it. I thought these were cute. They remind me of Timberlands almost. But I don't do Timberlands. Um, just for my own personal reasons. Which I used to love Timberland but i don't know more i don't support it so it just says cognac um it don't say what kind of shoes these are but they are super freaking cute i thought they would be perfect for what i'm going for in this new year it has a small heel to it yeah i mean like it's just a boot it's nothing more i could say oh i can tell you guys that these are in a size seven i believe oh you guys they're called gbg los angeles okay so i think these are a size seven if i'm not mistaken yes a seven and a half and these were 34 dollars. like i said got these to go into my shoe collection i am trying to build my shoe collection up so that my instagram pictures will be popping and stuff so but those are the two items that i forgot to show you guys so now back to the video at the last minute for christmas me and my son ran into walmart for something i can't even remember what we ran into walmart for but as we was walking in now the whole month of december you guys i was in walmart like 50 times and i don't know how i missed this but i was like oh my god that's cute i want it it came in different colors she got me the color that it that was left but i was like i need to have it. I told y'all I asked for a lot of I asked for a lot of cookware and kitchen items and I asked for this at the last minute but the good thing about it it was only like eight bucks and I thought it was super freaking cute and I love me some minis I love mini everything besides people I don't like midgets but I love many things like I thought this was super cute so this is a mini waffle maker and i be trying to do breakfast and stuff y'all i'm telling y'all i be trying to do stuff so i thought this would be super freaking cute to have to whip up the batter and do like waffles and not me continuing to buy frozen waffles and stuff so i was excited she did get red i i wanted the pink or the teal but she said they didn't have no more so she got the red and they also have like this little egg maker y'all I love to boil eggs. I love boiled eggs in my seafood, in my salads. I make devil eggs for like almost every holiday. And I'm the one that could burn boiled eggs. And I seen that little egg maker and it was like a little mini egg maker. I thought it was super freaking cute. But she said she didn't see it when she went back. And she only seen these red um, waffle makers. So I was like, cool with me i'm gonna find that egg maker and I'm gonna, I'm gonna get it i'm gonna get it um okay so we're down to the last three she also got me this real simple 
universal neck phone mount. She say when I'm going to bed, I'm always with my phone in my face and I'll drop it. But she is too. She will post her phone up on me as the stand and watch her watch her phone, YouTube, whatever the hell she be watching. She will use me as the stand, but she got me one. She should have got herself one as well. But I got a pink one and I'm still happy for it, but it's funny because she's gonna be using this too. She will be using this too. So this goes around the <clears throat> this goes around the neck. It says it's a flexible phone mount, holds any smartphone at a optimal viewing angle with 360 degree rotation. It also works as a freestanding smartphone stand. So here is all of the phones. It goes all the way from the iPhone to my Galaxy Ultra note this is the 20 ultra max the biggest uh samsung that has came out um it's a universal phone mount as well and it's flexible with long arms and a neck cushion and then my wife wrapped it up which was so awkward because i would have tore that wrapping paper up trying to wrap this <laughs> Y'all, it's the shape of a heart, and I thought it was so cute, but I thought it was like some candy or something. But you can use these for a storage after um, you use what's in it, because what's in it is, oh, it is so pretty. And this is what made me say I needed one of those bath benches things. Y'all, look at this. I thought this was super freaking cute. Don't know where she got it from. I didn't even ask. I thought it was so cute. Isn't this so cute? Okay, so the roses in here is actual soap. These roses, every last one of these roses is actual soap. I got a face mask. And then this one here is lavender yin yang chamomile. And this here is like a diffuser for when you're in a bathtub. It's a diffuser. She knows I love to soak in a tub and be in there for hours with the hottest water. Like, I love it. And it has the little cup right here, too. I'm scared to even tilt it now. Has the little glass right here, too, for the little wine and stuff. So, yeah. All right, so the last product I was making sure I showed everything is going to be my Bubble Bliss Deluxe Foot Massage Chair. I'm telling y'all, my wife was trying to tell me something. This is a pain relief for aching muscles. It has bubbles. It has a massager. Everything to this foot massager. And even though she's trying to tell me something about my feet, I'm glad she got this because I think it's going to be cute for in between nail shops type of things. I haven't been to the nail shop, I think, since my wedding. If I'm not mistaken, this foot bath is going to get some use. Okay. And you guys know I have a whole drawer of nail stuff that I just started getting into. You know, I work with um, Double Dip a lot for the nails and I bought a lot of poly gel and all that good stuff during quarantine last year. So I have a lot of nail stuff that I could take care of my own hands and my own feet in probably years and years and years back there at the back. Probably got enough for all of y'all. That is it. That is everything I got for my birthday and Christmas. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this haul. Let me know if you guys want that clothing review, you know, the try on. And um I don't know if y'all want to see any behind the scenes of me cooking with my air fryer or my new pots and pans, stuff like that. Maybe I'll include it in some monthly vlogs. Depending on how the monthly vlogs been going, I decided to do like monthly vlogs. But only if you guys want to continue to see though. Now it's time for me to put this stuff up and get to using it. So let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Click the notification bell, set it to all so you don't miss that weight gain video 
or the skincare video or any of the other videos that I will be having coming up. So, I love you guys and I'll talk to y'all in the next one. Deuces.